Your voice is an instrument powered by your diaphragm. Its fullness is your unique vocal imprint in a world full of noise. Just like a thumbprint, your vocal print is your unique inflection, pace, fullness, and stressing of syllables that makes hearing you different from hearing anybody else. So I wanna encourage you to master your own voice. It starts first of all with appreciating your unique tonality. Uh, our voices as instruments collectively make us all like a marching band or an orchestra. What you'll notice in a band is that not all instruments sound the same. Tubas have a deeper sound, flutes have a lighter sound. Saxophones sound one way, clarinets sound another. There are violins and cellos. They're similar but distinct. And so appreciate the tonality of your unique vocal instrument. There are some people who could be subconscious about how your voice sounds audibly. And you may envy the deep, full baritone of some other world-renowned speakers or voiceover uh, kings like James Earl Jones or Morgan Freeman. You may wish you sound more interesting. But I discovered something recently that most meditation music includes the sound of a flute. It is this high-pitched flute that is used more for meditation than some of the other smoother sounding instruments we would assume. So despite how your voice sounds, the goal is to use it in all its fullness. That means to breathe deeply. Breathe through your diaphragm, not your clavicle. Use it in all its fullness with your unique pacing and your unique inflection. And you'll notice that even if your tone gives away or betrays that you have a, a certain sound from a certain region of the world, that it will still be enjoyable and people will love the sound of your unique vocal instrument.